lies thousands of feet in the air. A new helicopter service is operating at TMH, allowing them to provide critical care to patients in record time. Survival flight launched earlier this year. First responders can even perform blood transfusions while they're in that helicopter. Our Savannah Kelly got a behind-the-scenes look. When TMH's survival flight team gets a call, there's only one thought in their mind. Do everything we can to save that person's life. There's not a second to spare. We're off the ground within minutes because time is of the essence. Flight nurse Trent Robinson says survival flight is a game changer for critical care in Tallahassee, allowing nurses and medics to quickly reach patients in rural communities that aren't easily accessible via ambulance. Whether you're having a, a heart attack or a stroke or you're involved in a, a traumatic injury, um, your care is going to be a lot quicker now that we can respond from TMH. And now survival flight is certified to carry blood on its helicopters. Nurses can administer life-saving transfusions while they're in the air. In the past, we used to only give IV fluids in the field. Now we can use blood and give you a blood transfusion before you get to the hospital. Survival flight often responds to patients who have lost a lot of blood due to a traumatic injury, like a car accident. Being able to give that blood before they get to the hospital a lot of times can save their lives. Survival Flight is the first helicopter service based at TMH in about a decade. Flight nurse Jacqueline Carr says the job is indescribable. I worked in the ER, but this is a whole different experience. She and her teammate Kyle Kluber work in an incredibly small space. You don't have a, a doctor with you. You don't have nursing staff with you. You literally just have you and your paramedic in this small, confined space. They say it's a team effort and a job that constantly keeps them on their toes. There's literally no job as awesome as this. Still, it comes with challenges. For Robinson, the worst calls are ones involving children. He says every time he responds to a call like that, he goes home and hugs his kids. We see a lot of terrible things out here. Uh, it makes you appreciate life, appreciate every day. Reporting in Tallahassee, Savannah Kelly, WCTV Eyewitness News. And Survival Flight can't do the work that they do without blood donations. The team encourages everybody watching tonight to consider donating blood to ensure that they continue to provide that life-saving treatment in the air to patients. So incredible. Incredible work. We'll be right back.